Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Jess, and my nails and Scarlett most likely will be later joining us in the background. So this is all the stuff that I'm going to be using today. I did order some more stuff online, but it just hasn't come and I'm like, I can't wait any longer because I just want to show you. They're pretty long and it's starting to get annoying to use like yeah so i just really want to take them off but they've lasted a really long time the only thing is um the biggest diamante on both of my pinkies fell off but other than that it's pretty good um so shout out to kt beauty what you'll need if you want to do your nails at home is acetone a hundred percent pure i got this off amazon i can list everything below you need some towels i've got two I've got a big one and a little one if you want to put some nail polish after, great. If not, that's fine. I have some tissues to put all the gunk and stuff on later. You'll need some files. I've got two. And then I've got this nail clipper because I want to cut my nails short. I want to kind of start them over again. And then I have this nail file that I will eventually throw out because you know when they get bad after a while, this will eventually get that way. But then I have the other ones backup um and i also have some vitamin e oil this is as well 100 percent pure i got this delivered today um and this is amazing for your nails it's amazing for your hair it's amazing for like literally everything so i'm going to be mixing that into my um nails the reason i have this bowl with hot water in it is because this will actually this is going to actually help the acetone to work quicker I'm just going to leave my hand in here for a bit and I'm going to just hope the diamantes will eventually fall off. And yeah, so we're going to just hang out here for a bit and see what happens. I should have played some music. Let me just quickly do that. All right, guys, so that's been about, I reckon, 20 minutes, half an hour. That's how they're looking so far. So what I'm going to actually do now, just going to move the bowl for a sec. We are going to pop them back in there. Definitely going to remove them. So I'm pretty much just going to start taking off anything that comes. Oh my gosh, so this is my fake nail. So this one's gonna hurt a little bit. Okay, so it's been about another 10 minutes and they look like they're all starting to come off. Okay, so I'm gonna cut my nails a bit because they are too long as well. So probably cut it like that much. That's pretty good. Probably like half an hour. So I'm just going to go ahead and cut the rest. I feel like it's just easier to do that. All right, so we're going to go back in. And I'm going to say we're going to go back in for another half an hour. And I'm literally just putting my nails like in as much as I can. Basically. Just going to add a little bit more. Alrighty, so that's kind of how we're looking now. <laughs> what? I'm being very gentle when I do this, by the way. I just kind of like want to pick out the gel. So the gel is pretty much all coming off. So I'm just going to go ahead and take them all off now. All right, guys, so this is how my nails are looking at the moment. I have cut them very short. Um, I'm just going to do one last batch because they're pretty much done. I always like to look in 
my nail to see so I feel like my right side is much like is easier than my left so um, I'm actually just gonna do it now hand by hand so I'm gonna do my left hand first and then we'll move on and do my right hand We're pretty much done. I had to, honestly, I ripped out most of them because I was getting so impatient um, to like, cause you gotta kind of peel like, you gotta kind of like rub them off so they all come out and it was just getting too much. So I'm gonna quickly just shape them up. If I need to cut any bits, I will, but I just want it to be round. You don't have a buffer I forgot to get one off price line to be honest so I'll do my nails this time and then when I do them again I'll do an extra pamper so my nails are all shaped literally I I haven't been able to do this in Oh my gosh, I feel so good right now. So I'm getting my vitamin E oil and now I'm gonna just pop a little bit of the oil on each nail. And now I want you to just massage your nail and take your time with this. You need some love, you know? So what I'm actually gonna do is leave my hands for about maybe five minutes, let the oil really soak in there, and then I'm just gonna wash my hands and then I'll be right back. I'm actually not gonna take it off. I'm just gonna kind of dab it off with this towel. Same thing on the other side. So now I'm actually gonna go in with the Sally Hansen Maximum Strength. They're done. So these are the after. So I hope this video helped. Um, honestly, it is quite a long process in my experience, probably because I didn't have the right tools. Um, I'm gonna do the same thing to my toes because I have shellac on them and see if that works. Otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching and have a lovely week. Mwah. Bye.